guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different than my usual. It is going to be a review of these glasses right here on my face. Now, if you don't watch my vlogs or follow me on Instagram, I think I post pictures of my glasses on Instagram. I don't really know, but I do wear glasses. I just, I don't when I'm filming because I'm nearsighted, right? When I can see things close up. I still don't know my terminology because I'll let you guys know my glasses story in a second, but so I don't really need my glasses to be filming. But my normal glasses are these right here. And I love my glasses, but when I was buying these, I also fell in love with a pair of Prada glasses that were like $400 and I wanted both these and those, but I was like, that's crazy. Why would I spend almost a thousand dollars on things that I only need to wear to see things far away and when I'm driving and not like every day, all the time use. I don't really need to spend that much money on glasses. You know when you're the blind person and all your friends always try on your glasses to see just how blind you are? See, I was that friend for over two decades and because everyone around me has worse eyesight than I do, I never realized that I had slightly impaired eyesight. I'd always put on people's glasses and be like, whoa, you can't see anything. How many fingers am I holding up? Like I was that person, even though I knew that being blind didn't make you see double, but you know, we do that. I'm, I'm sorry. This is probably why I need to wear glasses now because I was that, I was that person. And then just about two years ago, my boyfriend found out that he is very, 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 very slightly blind. So he got a pair of glasses because the army is like, you can't even be like this much blind without glasses. So he got glasses and we were in the car one night and he was telling me some sort of story and I was just goofing around and I put on his glasses and I looked at a street sign and suddenly the street sign was so, so very clear. And he's blabbing away telling me that story and I'm just sitting there staring at this street sign like this. Like, oh my God, I'm blind. Oh my God what is my life. So that's how I found out that I needed glasses. So a few weeks later I went and I got my eyes checked and I got a prescription and I tried on so many glasses. I ended up choosing these because I felt like they were more casual and more practical and they would match everything. Since choosing those I've always wanted to have a second pair of glasses. So this company called Firmu reached out to me and offered to send me a free pair of glasses for me to review for you guys. And obviously I said yeah because hello free pair of glasses but I also get to share this awesome website with you guys. At Firmu I didn't see a single pair that went over $40 and that's with a prescription in them. Like that is crazy to me. I could have sworn glasses were just this really expensive thing but somehow Firmu gets them to you for super cheap. And they have so many options. Honestly, I sat there for two hours scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and I would just open new tabs with ones that I kind of liked and I'd just keep scrolling and scrolling and after well, probably well over two hours, I narrowed it down to a style like this and then maybe another hour later, I chose these. When you're looking at all the different styles, they do put the dimensions of the glasses on the website so you can compare to your current glasses and usually your glasses will tell you like right over here either the model number or the dimensions of your glasses. Mine only tell me the model number and then that this part is 140 millime millimeters? Millimeters. That sounds right. But with a quick Google search of this exact model number, I found the width of the glass, the width of the bridge, and the width of them overall. I feel like this is just... I compared all those numbers to all of the glasses at Firmu that I was looking at and these seem to be the closest to these that would fit me the best because I do have quite a large face. It's a little bit wide so I was a little bit concerned that if they weren't wide enough that it would just look really weird and awkward. I mean you guys can let me know in the comments down below what you think of them. Just don't tell me that they look bad because I really like them so just like tell me that they look great. <laughs> so once I decided on these frames they have a page where you enter your prescription details and then you get to choose what kind of glass you want. If it's like anti-scratch I'm pretty sure was an option. And I got the ones that are like anti-reflective and UV resistant so that's why they look kind of green but I really typically mostly only wear my glasses at night when I'm driving. So these help a lot with the glare from street lights and from oncoming cars and stuff. And the anti-glare on these is kind of green tinted and on my other pair they're kind of blue tinted. And on my old pair even when there's nothing really reflecting off of them they do kind of have like a blue tint to them. So I actually really appreciate that they don't really glare a color when there isn't a light beaming on them. Like right now you guys see my softbox 
just reflecting in them, but I can't do anything about that. These glasses are also super lightweight. They are at least half the weight of my other pair of glasses, so I kind of forget that they're even on my face, which is really nice. And they came in this really interesting case. I mean, I have no idea what a map has to do with Fermu, but they came in this really cute, like, antique map looking case, and mine, sadly, really doesn't have much land printed on it, as you guys can see. The land mass is kind of, would have been right there. I think that's part of Africa. Oh no, I think that's South America. But there's a little boat on mine. They came with one of these microfiber cloths that let you know that their styles update every day and they're no more than $39. See, I think I said 40. I guess it was 39. I think this pair might have been 20. I might be wrong. I will link in the description to this exact pair if you guys want this pair of glasses so you guys can find the exact model number because I think they're super cute. And this case actually came inside of a soft pouch, so if you don't like having one of these take up half of your like handbag, you can just put them in this, which is actually awesome because my other glasses only have a hard case and sometimes I don't want to take an entire hard case with me. If you lose the little feet of your glasses, it came with two extras as well as a bunch of little screws and I'm assuming like a little screwdriver so that you can do- wow! That's awesome! My like expensive glasses didn't come with that so... What? <laughs> These also shipped to me super quick. I ordered them and they were in my mailbox I think it was six days later possibly five, with a weekend, which is crazy. So I'm honestly obsessing over having like a classier, less casual pair of glasses. I feel so like sophisticated and elegant with the little gold wire rim. And I honestly want to buy like six more pairs of glasses now that I know how easy and cheap Fermu is. And if you guys are not blind like I am, you can actually get non-prescription lenses in your glasses or they have sunglasses and they're actually running this awesome offer on the website right now where if you buy one pair, you get a second pair for free. So you can get two pairs of glasses for like $20, which is crazy. If you don't like the pair or pairs that you choose, they have a 30 day return and exchange policy, as well as a three month warranty on all of their glasses. So if you don't like the pair that you chose, if they're a little bit too big, a little bit too small, you can send them back get a different pair. But I think that's just about everything I have to say about my new Fermu glasses. I really enjoyed my online shopping experience and I'm so happy I was able to share this with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video even though it's a little bit different and I thank you guys so much for watching it. In the comment section down below, let me know if you guys are nearsighted, farsighted, have astigmatism, are one of those lucky people who have perfect 2020 vision like I thought I did for two decades and apparently don't. And I would love to keep up with you guys across all of my social media platforms. I always have links to them all in the description box down below. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, you totally should. I post new videos every Tuesday and Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!